positions and we are holding only these guys so let's go through them uh, tata steel and i keep saying these steel stocks i'm i'm still i kept saying back here i'm still bullish on these steel stocks i think they still have uh, some ways to go um, we're still holding the fifth position on this one we are not putting any price targets on that we want to see how high it can go uh, if it closes again if somebody is not willing to take this uh, lose this much profits here uh, then one should close the position uh, but from a hypothetical point of view we're going to see where the fifth position goes uh, or if it closes below the keygen we'll be closing the fifth position um, sale we are holding the third unit we have taken two units out we are holding for 100 on this guy uh, and then 106 for the fourth unit so uh, this one another by the end of this week, the Kijan should move up a little bit and next week it should start really ramping up. So I still think this one has uh, one more leg. But again, um, we're holding the third unit, uh, no closing below the Kijan on this guy. Uh, Britannia, we're still holding that guy. Big move down on uh, Friday. I uh, don't know if it was earnings related or what. Um, if it was earnings related, then you should be getting out. Uh, I didn't see any news though uh, on, a, on this front, so it might be just a, uh, just might be a selling day. But again, close below Kijan. Uh, if it closes below Kijan, you're out of the position. Hopefully they can support it on the 200 and uh, do a bullish Haromi or something before starting back up. But this one probably is going to go undergo consolidation just because of the way this Tenkan is. It's starting to head down. Um, Chicago might be bumping into these candles. So as long as they don't close below the Kijan, we can still hold it and uh, see if they can do a next leg up. The weekly chart also, um, oh, the weekly chart was bumping into this uh, candle for the Chicago. So uh, they might be able to support right there on the 50 week moving average and the Kijan, maybe an intraday test and start going up again. Strong Kumo, look at the Kumo. Mm -hmm. Well, I, I won't press the Kumo just because of this candle. I don't know, that probably is a bad data point. So. JSW Energy. This one we are holding the third unit. We are waiting for 106. It came to about 104.7 on Wednesday or whenever this was uh, not not close enough. Uh, so we'll waiting for taking the third unit out at 106. Still looking good. Um, Prakash, we were holding the fifth unit on this gap. It should have been closed when it closed below the Kijan. So uh, this position, the fifth unit is closed out. This one had pretty good profits. Uh, 